today we're opening up a total of, I think it's $530 in mystery boxes. So this is, this should be very fun. So I have one box. That was a $430 mystery box from Boom Loot. Uh, one of the vaulted epic grail exclusive boxes, four pops or $400 box. So that should be interesting. But as the appetizer, I actually have a brand new company that I purchased from. This is actually the person I bought this from. He actually sells on whatnot, but he's bought for me now for, wow, over a year, I bet. He bought, he's bought a lot of my, my expensive Fungal Pop Grails. And I just saw he recently started selling mystery boxes on his whatnot account. So I figured, hey, let me give one of his boxes a shot. Why not? So this one is called the Epic Maw, M-A, Epic Maw, Bracklet Funko Pop Mystery Box Guaranteed Value, $100. His whatnot username is, I'll just spell it for you, M-A-B-R-A-C-L-E-T. Mabroclet, I guess that's how you say it. This box contains between one to four Funko Pops guaranteed value. May contain commons, exclusives, vaulted, chases, glow in the dark, flocked, or diamond. The floor value is $100, so you're guaranteed at least your money back. The ceiling is $800, the average box value, 150 bucks. He had 50 total boxes. I'm not sure how many are available as of the time of this recording. Whenever I'm recording this, there's 42 available left. So I don't know what the top hits are or anything, but this is the first ever box I've purchased from him. And yeah, I like to support people that support me. And uh, what's his name, Michael? Michael has supported me and bought literally thousands of dollars of pops from me over the past year or so. So I figured, yeah, let me try one of his mystery boxes. Why not? Let's do this. This is the appetizer to warm up for the main course. Okay, right on top. Okay, on top we have a letter. It says, thank you. We hope you enjoy your epic mystery box purchase. As a small thank you, we'd like to offer you a virtual high five. Thanks again for your support. We'll see you online soon. Operation Funko. Oh yeah, check him out on Instagram. Operation Funko. He probably has one of the, probably, I bet you top 10 collections in the world when it comes to Fungal Pops. If there's a grail, he's got it. The yeah, Operation Funko. And then, actually there's all his information and my broccoli on whatnot. So I did buy this. This is not a gift or anything. I actually bought this. $100. Yeah. You ready to do this? Box. Okay, it is a box in a box. Box in a box, 100 bucks. Box number two, let's see what kind of goodies are in this thing. I mean, it's guaranteed value no matter what. So, I mean, it's a win-win situation, right? Win-win. It's always nice to buy a mystery box's guaranteed value. Okay, pull back the bubble wrap. Lots of bubble wrap. There we go, there's the end of it. Don't look, don't peek. Okay, so I feel Okay, so I feel four pops in here. Two are in like hard stacks. Two are in soft protectors. So it's one of four pops per box. Here we go. First one. We got Psyduck Pokemon. I don't really know much about Pokemon, so I can't really tell you much about this character. This one came out in 2021. So it came out two years ago now. But it is a Pokemon Psyduck. Let me see if these... Okay, this... That hard stack is wrapped so it's probably going to be actually what's that one next that was probably gonna be an art series yep it is art series everybody knows not a huge fan of art series pops because it's just they aren't the prettiest things out there are they not really but brand new still sealed in the pop stack uh winter was it captain america and the winter soldier art series not bad probably like what 30 bucks i bet here we go, next one. This is a soft protector. We'll do all four of these, we'll see value, and then we'll do the $430 mystery box. This one, oh, cool, we got Red Hulk. Is this the chase? Not the chase, but I will take it. This is a super cool pop. Red Hulk came out in 2021. Yeah, Harrison Ford's supposed to play the, um, the actor who plays, or play the character of Red Hulk. The actual character in Marvel who is Red Hulk, I can't think of what the, what the character's name is on top of my head, but Supposed to be Harrison Ford, supposed to play that character, so Harrison Ford is going to be Red Hulk. Here we go. This one is in a stack. There's some stickiness on it. So it looks like it is taped shut. We have. Oh, nice. The back says Bane. What did we get? The Bane, the OG Bane. Sweet. I wish I would have had this back when Tom Hardy was doing his private signing. I had Tom Hardy sign a Venom Pop for me. And this one is actually 
very minty. Wow. So this is a 2015 pop. So it is eight years old. This one is very, very minty. This thing's like, I don't want to say 10 out of 10, but it's it's like 9.5 out of 10 dish for an eight year old pop. That is in crazy good condition. This one needs to be autographed by Tom Hardy. First pop, Psyduck, $11. Pop number two, Red Hole coming in at 12 bucks. Pop number three, Captain America, <laughs> PBG value $11. The pop stack is worth more than what the pop's worth. Most people kind of agree with me. Most people aren't fans of the Art Series pops. But yeah, this pop stack's actually worth more than what the pops are worth. It's kind of funny, isn't it? And last one, Bane coming in at 160 bucks, but this one is very minty. I mean, this thing is, I don't want to say 10 out of 10, but it's its like 9.9 .9 out of 10. This thing is in fantastic condition. So grand total of this mystery box, I spent, what did I say, 100, and we're walking away with 194. So almost a double up, fantastic. So I said the average the average price back is around 150, so I got a little bit above the average value. Of course, this was not the top box. The top one was like, what I say, 800? But yeah, not too bad. Actually, I might pick up some more of his mystery boxes. I think he had ones for 50 also. So I actually might pick up some more of these. I'm, I'm happy with this. Everything's in fantastic shape. Even the cheapy pops come in soft protectors, so that's a bonus. Now it's time for the main course. $430 mystery box limit, one per customer. This shipped back on April the 12th. So I had this thing for over a month now. All the details. Each boom box contains four pops for $430. So you're spending like what? Uh, $108 a pop on average. So there's gonna be some grails in here. The lowest value of the boom box, the time of packaging is 430. It's guaranteed value. The highest value is over $900. So you can get over double your money back. There are only 15 boom boxes, so you have a one in 15 chance of doubling your money. That's actually very, very good odds. Limit of one per customer, I got my one. It says all box conditions are near mint to mint. Eight out of 10 condition or better. So there should be no damages. I'm ready to see what's in this thing. A one out of 15 chance of getting top hit. That's really good odds. I always like buying the mystery boxes where like the top box odds are pretty good. This should be like box in a box. Yeah, box in a box. If I can get it out. Box in the box, boom loop. Here we go, show you it's all sealed up. Four pops per box. We got the boom box. Here we go, come on. Need something big. If it's a $900 possible box, that means somebody's gonna get out some Big boy grails out of these. I don't know what the top hit hits were. I didn't I didn't go back and check. So it's kind of a mystery to us both, right? Here we go. Let's feel around. Okay, they're all four and salt protectors. I know Boombox usually doesn't use like hard stacks or anything. They usually just use the salt protectors for the good hits. You ready? I don't know which one's gonna be the best hit in this box. First one, the back says G.I. Joe. Cobra Commander, this has a sticker on it, it says this is worth $30. This is the bait pre-release exclusive. That's a nice pop right there. A lot of people look like G.I. Joe, it's all 2015. It's an eight-year-old pop, so you know it's vaulted. Nice hit, 30 bucks. Guaranteed value is 430. We got $4 more in value in the next three pops. Here we go, next one. You ready? Ooh, Brooke. That's gonna be my big hit in that box right there. We got the Brooke from One Piece coming in. Back says $350. Wow. This one is a nice one. This is a grail to a lot of people out there. I've actually never had this pop, I don't think. Or if I have, it's like maybe the second time I've ever had this pop. This might be the first time. That's a big hit right there. That's a big boy kind of a hit. I'll take it. I will take it. Here we go. Next one. Man thing, Marvel come in as back says seventy dollar. This is twenty nineteen SDCC shared sticker of Man Thing with Marvel. Not bad. And last pop. So right here we're looking at like what four hundred fifty bucks. So just right here, these three, I'm already over what I paid for this box. Here we go, last one. Says superheroes Nightwing, the twenty twenty 
share sticker nightwing worth 55 bucks we got we got over five dollars in value back let's go ahead let's see pbg value let's see what values might have done first pop with that pre-release bait sticker coming in at 30 bucks value did not change Pot number two, we got Nightwing 2020 shared sticker coming in at 55 bucks. Value did not change. Pot number three, we got Man Thing 2019 SCCC shared sticker coming in at 70 bucks. Value did not change. Pot number four, we have the Brook, the 2018 NYCC shared sticker, which is an anime grail. This is a one piece grail coming in at 370 bucks. Value went up $20. Grand total of this box, I bought it for 430, got back 525 bucks, so almost hundred dollars more than what I paid. So I am happy with that. I am happy with that. So like, what 25 percent or so more than what I paid? I'm good with that. I'm happy. This is a good value box. It was not the top hit box, obviously, but I got four very solid pops. No trash, no filler, no junk. Everything's a brand new pop protector, and everything looks to be in fantastic condition. So not much more I can ask for. If you want to buy these pops, these will be for sale in my next whatnot auction this coming Friday night, which is I think is May 19th. May 19th, 2023 at 6 p.m. Eastern time will be my next whatnot live auction. I actually will be selling around 20 or so Silver Age and Bronze Age comic books. I'm still going to sell some key comics. I'm going to have 30 maybe or so pops to auction off. I'm going to have buy it nows. I'm going to do giveaways. It's going to be fun. Make sure you check out Whatnot this Friday night at 6 p.m. when I do a live Funko Pop and comic book auction. If you never download Whatnot app, there'll be a direct link down below in the description box of this video. Click that link for Whatnot. Download the completely free app. If you use my link down below also, you'll save 15 bucks on your very first purchase. So it's possible you might be able to get this pop for completely free. If it sells for 15 bucks, your first pop could be completely free. So use my link down below. Download the app. I'll see you this Friday night, 6 p.m. Eastern time only on the whatnot app.